Hello, uh, very good day for you. And today, Agripedia YouTube channel is going to talk with you about uh, Israel and Lebanon war condition, uh, how it can impact on the uh, Sri Lankan tea industry. Uh, you know, currently, uh, the Israel and Hezbollah is engaged in the war, war and uh, Israel's uh, IDF is uh, and Hezbollah is fighting each other. So this is a current uh, crisis rising in the Middle East area. So we would like to focus on how this conflict impact on Ceylon tea industry. So according to the different websites, Sri Lanka is exporting around 2 million kilograms per year to the Lebanon. This is the data mentioned in CeylonTeaWorkers.com. Uh, this data mentioned uh, uh, January to April in 2024, the total quantity already exported to the Lebanon is around uh, uh, 570,994 uh, kilograms. So this is, if we predict this amount to the actual uh, total 12 months, it is around 2 million kilograms. So this is a huge amount with compared to the total market size of the Lebanon. When you look at the statista.com, so you can understand what is the market size of the Lebanon in the tea. Uh, the normal, uh, the total value of in-house value is uh, USD million 103 and out-of-house uh, market size is uh, 53 million USD 24 according to the statista. So total market size is around 157 million according to the statista. So also the total market size of the quantity size is actually 3.05 million kilograms in uh, 2024. So the, the per capita consumption of uh, the, the tea is around 500 grams according to the statista and they, they are still showing some kind of negative growth of the market. Uh, so when you look at the Sri Lankan scenario, the Currently, they have imported uh, around uh, first four months, they have imported 570,994 kilograms and the total market size is uh, 3 million. But uh, with, with compare with the total amount of the Ceylon tea export is to Lebanon is uh, 2 million. The As a proportion, it is 70%, uh, around 70%. This is a huge quantity, a huge, a huge percentage with compared to the market size so the total market size is a uh, 3 million kilograms and the ceylon tea is exported to the as a quantity 2 million it's a 70 percent round so because of this war conditions uh, the uh, people in lebanese uh, and actually lebanese uh, sometimes they will reduce the consumption of uh, tea and sometimes they will maintain because the current list the lebanon also has uh, pace uh, actually they are facing economic crisis so because of that they are the, the amounts they can expend in, on unessential goods so the money they have the disposable income they have to expend on the tea is also reducing so the demand for Ceylon tea or other tea will uh, down in coming future within next two three months the demand for the Ceylon tea will decline uh, due to this work we uh, work condition so uh, we have to get ready actually as the Ceylon tea producers have to concern on the, the, the what is going on in the Middle East because uh, when you look at the total market size uh, in the world tea market is actually uh, uh, last five years is, has mentioned that uh, 53 billion USD. But the market research companies, they are predicting uh, this market value or market size will rise or will enlarge into the 100 billion uh, USD uh, in coming five years. And especially this uh, Middle East, uh, the expansion of the Middle East families uh, in the China, Japan, and India will capture this market. So the, the actual market uh, rise in the future is in, in India, China, and Japan, and South Korea. So in Ceylon tea producers, they have to focus and they have to rethink about their market because currently they are 80 percent of the production is going to the middle east and the rest is going to the actually go to the middle east after that uh, reshipping to the asian countries but uh, silicon tree producers have to concern they will have to rethink their marketing strategies in future 
to capture this growing market uh, in the east asian countries so with this is the news uh, today we discuss uh, on behalf of agripedia youtube channel so we come up with new news segments in a short while with that thank you very much